budgeters and savers, Chris Budgets here with another video for you guys. If you guys are new to my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you guys are up to date on all of my content. If you guys are new, hi, hello, my name is Chris. I'm a mom, a wife, a worker bee, and we are out here working and twerking so we can become debt free. So you guys, I have, you know, to do my cash stuffing for my second paycheck of August and I actually got paid last Wednesday, but I have been been so busy living life you guys know summertime is our busiest time as a family we have birthdays family events all of the things you guys you guys know we are outside so I'm a little bit behind as per usual because you guys know when I film late and then the video doesn't get edited um, you know I just it's a chain reaction but but you guys I'm working on it so please forgive me um, today we actually well I should say tonight because it is now 11 11 make a wish y'all make a wish and my wish is that my video will go viral um, but tonight or earlier tonight I was on Chris from budgeting just because her YouTube live so that was so much fun shout out to Chris from budgeting just because thank you so much for having me on your live I appreciate you and also shout out to Crystal from budget by the bag or as Jacob says a budget by the baggy okay mr. spider-man over there um, the live was so much fun you guys it was my first time doing a YouTube live like joining a YouTube live I have yet to go on YouTube live by myself but it was so much fun so thank you to everyone who tuned in there's gonna be much more lives coming up I've seen in the community so be sure you guys have your notifications turned on I saw Aaron um, and also Marlene and I believe Taylor are gonna be going live um, next month in September something um, I forgot the exact date I don't want to say the wrong date but I will have everything linked in the description below so I'm excited about that and you guys it's just so much fun being on live and chatting with everyone and just you know seeing Crystal's face that is always nice um, she's gorgeous so I hope I see her face some more and yeah it was so much fun so thank you again Chris um, I will have everyone linked um, from those lives down below and the information for um, the lives for next month and then I believe Chris from budgeting just because is going to be doing lives on Thursday I believe she said so lots of stuff going in the community you guys I try to keep up but it's been so tough because I haven't been you know as active during these summer months we have been so busy so let's go ahead and get started with my cash stuffing I do not have a budget breakdown written down for anybody I am just living life okay you feel me you feel me because again I'm last minute and then on top of that I'm going through some transitions with my budgets and everything like that so before we get started with the cash stuffing I wanted to go ahead and let you guys know in case you guys you know see anything weird or maybe I forget to mention it because I do a lot of things off camera and don't mention it sometimes or mention it later and I'm trying to remember you know I can't remember everything to say in a video but I'm trying okay I'm trying so for my cash envelopes over here I actually emptied these out I needed to empty them out because you guys know I have been trying to pay with my credit card and I have been so it's time to pay that credit card and I went ahead and empty these out the only thing I left was for gas so for gas we have $20 I just left that in there because we might be going to the amusement park again so I just was gonna leave that in there but everything else as you guys can see is empty you guys know these gorgeous gorgeous watercolor envelopes are from Sam's Crafts and Customs I left everything else the same so this treat myself um, is in here Arya's envelope the outside envelope is still looking good and of course dead and I might have to make a deposit with my debt envelope it's just getting a little thick um, but these rose gold beautiful beautiful rose gold envelopes are from princess budgets the og and these are the cheetah diagonal peekaboo envelopes i know i change the name on them all the time because i don't know the official like what she's officially calling them but this is what i'm calling them and these are from daisy budgets she's a little mia right now because she just moved and you guys please check her out she also just created a kind of like a vlog ish channel like a 
like a non-budgeting channel I should say so be sure to check her out I will have her linked in the description but these envelopes are from her so I'm probably gonna make a debt deposit soon um yeah I need to do that because it's looking a little she looking a little thick she looking a little you know like me so I just want to let you guys know I made those changes I pulled the money out from my cash envelope so you know being accountable here okay you guys i'm out here being accountable doing the best that i can so today we are cash stuffing 700 dollars and i have my cash right over here i did switch wallets this wallet is from oh i almost forgot 100 you guys and then i would have been upset when i miscounted embarrassing and i did have some ones that i'm going to be putting in my cash jar my wallet this wallet right over here and this cash jar is actually from Katie2i Budgets. So if you haven't yet, please subscribe to her, follow her on Instagram and her shop. Congratulations to Katie. She just graduated and she just had her birthday all on the same day, you guys. So exciting. So please, if you haven't yet, check her out. She works so, so hard. She just did a video update like a week or two ago about life. She's been a little MIA, but can you blame her? The girl is great graduating that's why obviously so congratulations to her it's such a huge 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 accomplishment to be graduating and then of course it's your birthday like how fun is that so this is from her and be sure to check out her life update so again you guys it is $700 for today and before I count this money which I'm hoping it's correct because obviously you guys i have some other denominations today this 10 is kind of worrying me i made my own change off camera because i didn't want to put up with like filming it and the film like the video was most likely going to be 100 years so that's why i made change off camera but before i count this let me go ahead and grab some lotion okay here we go right over here so a little sunshine mimosa and I will go ahead, because I don't want to be dry. Gotta rub it in, in those cuticles, you guys. We don't want dry cuticles. I'm trying to avoid my jewelry as best as I can, even though, you know, it just gets dirty sometimes, but whatever. Okay, so let's see. Oof, well, let me grab this 10. So 100, 200, 250, 270, 290, ah, 300, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 400, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 500, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 600, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 700. Thank God I did it that way, you guys. That was smooth, right? A little pause, but there, it was smooth overall. So I'm excited about that. I don't even think, like, I'm trying to rush because my husband, Mr. Budgets, wants to watch She-Hulk on Disney Plus after I film. So it is 11.19. I at least want to do get, like, one episode out of the way. I don't know if you can see my watch. So it's 11.19. I want to at least watch one episode. So I'm trying to rush this video. So I apologize if, you know, I'm rushing. because It's because I am, okay? So... I have my little cheat sheet next to me and this is what we're going to be doing. Groceries is going to get $200. So my cash envelopes, the amounts pretty much stayed the same. They're about $400 and you guys know during the second half of, of the month, I pay for my Verizon bill, which it went down to $150 and then it jumped to $161 and it's been $161 for like, for um, I feel like for forever. You guys, I don't even know. I need to call Verizon and see what they're doing over there, but you know, it is what it is at this point. So groceries is gonna get 200. And I'm actually gonna split this up. One, two, three, four, five. So that's 200 for groceries. Food is gonna be getting 100 let me move this up a little bit 
one, two, three, four, five. And I wanted to say a huge thank you to everyone um, because I did hit 2,000 subscribers. So I'm so excited about that, which means I will be having a giveaway. And I did receive some comments and stuff on my Instagram about what you guys wanted to see for a giveaway. I think I'm gonna do a poll on the community tab and see, you know, um, what would be the best thing to give away. There's so many options. It's just, it gets overwhelming. So that's why I'm like, Ugh, I need to get it together. But I am excited. So huge thank you, you guys. Now, if YouTube would only cut me my check. Oh, and I just put $20 in gas. Spending is gonna get $60. So $60, you guys, oh my gosh. I didn't even check if I had star notes, but it's too late now. I, I have committed, they're in the envelopes. All right, and then miscellaneous is gonna get $20. And then, let me see. So I did wanna stuff like my treat myself envelope and I have to figure out like what I'm gonna do because I do wanna get my nails done again. So I think I'm gonna stuff my treat myself envelope. Uh, I don't know, what do you guys think? I think I am, I think I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna put, cause I wanna get my nails done. So I think I'm gonna put, <sighs> hmm. All right, let me think you guys. Okay, I think I'm gonna put $50 in here in my treat myself envelope. Or maybe I'll just put $40, okay. Hmm. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put $40 in my treat myself envelope. Well, you guys, okay, let me think. I just don't know. I don't know what to do. I did not decide this far, but you guys know I haven't done any savings challenges for the month of August, so I'm gonna put this $50 aside and put it towards my August savings challenge. I haven't physically done a savings challenge, but I know that I st still wanna beat my numbers for the previous quarter. If you guys haven't yet, be sure to watch my savings challenge update. I will have it linked right over here because I'm trying to save money every month, no matter what the challenge is or what the month is. I'm still trying to save a little bit of something. So I'm gonna put this aside like literally physically put it aside. And while I do that, I'm gonna think about how much I want to spend. So I know a few things, you guys. I know I need to pay off some debt. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and put $50 in self-care. So I'm gonna do that in my, these are my self-care envelopes, are the ones from Princess Budgets. So there are three envelopes, so one for books, clothing, and treat myself. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put $20 in clothing. I'm not gonna put anything in books because I have not had the time to read any books right now. I have one more book that I need to read that I have that I've already purchased. It's at home, it's with me. I need to read it. And the $30 is going into my treat myself envelope, which is kind of like get my nails done or get a massage type of thing. But I really do wanna get my nails done um, or get a pedicure maybe. So I'm gonna put that in there. And then I have 100, two, four, six, eight. So I have $200 left and I'm going to put, I'm not gonna be stepping outside right now because summer is coming to an end. So what I am gonna put it towards is a debt. So I'm gonna put $40 towards debt. And let me grab um, my other sinking fund binder real quick. Okay, so I actually just did a sinking fund update. I will have that linked right over here. And for my sinking fund update, I kind of just went over like what I have for this and my car. So let me check how much I have for my car. Oh, thank God, is this real? Oh, I thought it was a placeholder for a second. I got nervous. So I have $100 in my car envelope, which is perfect because registration is coming up soon or my tags or whatever it's called. So what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna go ahead and put another 100 in there. 
and that will be for my car so I'm excited about that and then let me grab my coffee envelope so I don't know the last time you guys seen this but I'm gonna stuff it because I have a little bit of extra left so after putting that 100 in my car envelope I feel confident about that I feel good about that so I'm gonna go ahead and put $20 into my coffee envelope Ooh. My hands are so slippery from that lotion. I don't know if you guys can tell. And this coffee envelope is also from Sam's Crafts and Customs. I love this so much. It's so cute. I, uh, let me, hold on. Oh, here we go. I actually have a Chris envelope from her as well. That's so cute. Um, but I'm only gonna be stuffing coffee. And then for my $40, I don't really know what I'm gonna do with my $40 just yet. Um, I can't think of anything to put it in, but let me tell you what. Let me see. I don't know. I might actually, I'm going to put this $40 to the side along with my $50 because I know I want to save this. I'm going to put my $50 towards my monthly savings challenge and my $40 I'm going to keep aside because I know I need to really get it together for my savings challenges. So I'm going to save these for my savings challenges. So keep that in note, you guys, 50 plus 20 plus 20, that's $90 that is going to be going towards something else. And that's what happens when you don't write your budget down and you're trying to watch a show, okay? But it is what it is. That is what I'm trying to do. I prioritize my budget, our finances, as well as my family. So I'm about to go watch, you know, She-Hulk or whatever the green girl is, whatever her name is. And that is it for my video, you guys. No shout outs today. I'm just breezing on through, rushing on out of here. And that is it. If you guys have gotten to this part of the video, please let me know if you like my video. Don't forget to comment and subscribe. Comment and subscribe to each other, support each other. And if you guys want a shout out, please let me know. And that's it, you guys. Thanks so much for tuning in. Have a good one.